Hello, Darth Vegan here, back with another episode of Kerbal Space Program. Last episode, we brought Valentina back from Duna, and she is now my highest level Kerbal. So, uh, good job to her for going to Ike and back. And uh, we've got lots of, lots and lots and lots of Kerbals out there doing their jobs, but uh, you know, a lot of them need to come home. They've been out for a while for a while and I, I'll probably do that off screen but I wanted to take a look at our missions to see what we had available and what we have to do we haven't we're supposed to build another surface outpost on Minmus uh, we already have one really but uh, and it I thought it would uh, meet the requirements of this but for whatever reason it hasn't so I'm not exactly sure about that um, conduct observational surveys of Minmus, okay. Plant another plant a flag on Ipe, we already did that, but we can do it again. Explore Duna, transfer crew between vessels near Duna. Go on an orbital spacewalk near Duna, okay. We could probably do that with what we have there if we could get some fuel to that <laughs> ship that's on Duna itself. Um, expand the surface outpost, uh, moon miner MK2 on the moon, okay. At least 21 Kerbals have to be supported. Wow, that's gonna be a big. That's gonna be a big one. Um, extract ore from the moon. I'm in the process of trying to do that, and I think that's what we're gonna try to do today. Um, acquire 3,000 units of fresh ore from the moon. Have 3,000 units of ore in your vessel, and put the ore in the orbit. In orbit of Kerbin. So, um, what I'm what I'm gonna try to do. This is just a test run. I normally don't do my test runs on camera, but I just thought I would this time. I've actually tried two different haulers. This one, this first one, MK1, he's got some torque issues, so I'm not sure if I'm going to do anything with him. MK2, uh, I've got him landed on the moon. I, I did the launch off camera, nothing spectacular. Um, and we'll just take a look at what he's got here. Basically, what we've got here is a small um, basically liquid fuel engine that that uh, maintains stability for us uh, and then these um, ore tanks that will assist us in um, getting the fuel from uh, back to or the orbit of Kerbin <laughs> so that is all theoretical because um, I've got to find a way to get this ore from the miner to the hauler. So the miner should be around here somewhere. There he is. Um, how much ore does he have in him? He's got 1,500. Yeah, he's got 1,500. So I would have to land with this guy get the ore and then um, yeah there he is land on this guy get the ore and then relaunch and land at the other base and get the ore from them I, I don't know if that's feasible or not really to the truth I kind of thought it might be neat to have a bigger ship with some ore containers in orbit um, and then have them just launch up and and uh, meet with them and then uh, do that but <clears throat> anyway I would like to just drive this over to to the ship over there and uh, but unfortunately I can't control this thing I forgot we broke the uh, we broke the uh, <laughs> antenna when we when we landed so let's go ahead and get these things back in um, I'm gonna try to I'm gonna try to launch this thing and land it on this yeah probably not gonna work but uh, we're gonna try it just for fun I mean I'm gonna go ahead and save it because you know we're gonna retry it again and again and again over and over and over I'm just working under the assumption I will not be able to do it the first time so the first thing I'm gonna try to do is we are going to try to launch 
this separately from that. So I'm going to turn on my RCS. I'm going to say control from here. And I'm going to decouple this node like this. All right, and then I'm gonna launch up. And we are going to try to go that way. Yeah, this is it's gonna be tough. Now, if we were closer, it wouldn't be too bad. I don't know that we're gonna have enough fuel to do this, really, to tell you the truth. I should have put some wheels on this. I mean, this would have been fine to do something like that. But, uh, I gotta get that off there because that's bothering me. Okay. Now. Let's stop that. Can I roll this? Do I have a reaction wheel on this thing? I don't. If I had a reaction wheel, maybe I could just roll it over there. <laughs> Alright, let's see if I can... Uh, that's not working. Okay. Yeah, this this is uh, not looking too good. Right, let's turn that way. Oops. Whoops, whoops. Yeah. Okay, let's try that again. Let's try not to land on the ground this time. I just need to get my directionals uh, set up so that I know which way to do my thrusts. Okay. Control from here. Decouple. Okay. Turn this way. All right. All right, here we go, here we go. All right, let's go the other way. Oh boy, this is going to be tough. Okay. Oh boy. Oh, this is going to be near, near impossible. This thing, the duster, for whatever reason, it reminds me of one of those little dusters. Swiffer picker uppers. Not sponsored on this video, by the way. Oh, darn. Okay. One more try, and then we'll probably just say, yeah, we need we need something a little more robust. A little more controllable. Actually, you know what, this time, I think I'll try to use my rocket engines to uh, to move us over there. Um, because you, you know how well I can pilot these things. <laughs> That's a joke. I'm awful. Okay, here we go. I am just having trouble with the controls, period, today. Just having trouble with controls, period. Go towards the light. Okay. I 
No, no. Go towards the light. Alright, just kill that. Now go away from the light. Here we go. Let's just kill our velocity here. What are you? No! No! Oh. Yeah, that didn't work out. Okay. So this is what we're going to do. This thing is going back up into orbit. And I'm basically going to give up on it. I'll just leave it here for now. I mean, it's not hurting anything. But we're going to go back to Kerbin. And we're going to change... Um... Gonna, we're gonna do something else with this miner. First of all, we're gonna put a reaction wheel on it because I feel like we could control it a lot easier if we had a reaction wheel on this bad boy. So let's get the um, ore hauler. Boop, 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 boop. Lots of ships. Lots of crappy, crappy ships. Alright, so this is going to be MK3, by the way. Alright. Let's go ahead and make this compact. Alright. I'll probably have to redo this uh, launcher as well. Okay, let's go ahead and get the fairing off. This is going to pretty much stay the same. He will launch it into space, assuming that we can, um, hmm, I need a way to get back onto the launcher, though. I wonder if this whole thing had wheels. Hmm. I wonder if I took this off, took these off. Get those off of there. Um, let's take that off. Take this off. Okay. I don't think I'll need these. At least not in that not in that way okay Don't need, I will need the legs still because we're still gonna land and we'll just have to rotate these thrusters about okay something there. There we go. Okay. <clears throat> so now if I put wheels on this thing, put wheels on it similar to the wheels I used on the other one I don't think I need to I think we just need some very minor some little little crappy wheels just to get us over there and then we can use some thrusters hmm. if I were to put this thing like
that and like that. Okay. And let's just rotate them. end up in different inclinations because <laughs> you're stupid oh that's why okay something like that and then you know I could go I could fall down to either side sure if this will work or not. I'm thinking, thinking. I will need a uh, docking port on the top. Okay. Like so. Alright, and we'll also need a reaction wheel. Because I'm, I'm sick of not having reaction wheels. Sick of it, I tell you. Sick of it. There we go. Alright, so if this thing can drive on these little wheels and then use the thrusters that I'm going to put on there, <laughs> then all should be well. No. Those are in alignment, I can't tell. I think they are. Okay. Maybe a little bit closer in the back than they are in the front. Wish there was a way I could just launch just this thing. If only. If only there was a way. <laughs> Kidding, of course there is. Um, I'm going to save this as MK3. Take that off, and this is going to be MK3 test. Save that and launch it. Mm-hmm. Boop -a -dee boo 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 Okay. Now let's just tip over. Tip over. Uh, tip over. Do something. Tip this thing. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I can't even tip over. Um, maybe if I just do one leg. Oh, I can't do just one leg. It's unfortunate. Okay, well, I got an idea. I've got an idea, a temporary idea, called a um, Werner engine. Okay.
All right, let's launch this baby. Let's crack her down. Why are these not working? Jeez, still nothing. Let's disable these. Mm, that. That. And that. Seriously, wow. Still not enough. Okay, that's fine. Well then, I know a way to do that. Didn't think I would have to go to these lengths, but apparently I will. I have to put a little rocket engine on here. Nothing to it. Okay. A little rocket engine called a Twitch. <clears throat> we're going to pop this baby right here and we're going to rotate him just like so and I'm going to activate it I'm going to pump up the volume dance dance, dance, dance okay here we go Jiminy Christmas. All right. Activate the engine. Really? Really? This thing's solid as a rock. Okay. Well, there goes that idea. I'm going to spend as much time trying to tip this thing over as I am anything else. I need some I need some good thrust here. 16. Put a spark on here. There we go. And there we go. Is this gonna be enough? Jeez, who knows? That's got 13. This is 16. Maybe I should put another one on here. Okay. What I'm trying to do is I'm just trying to tip it. Just trying to tip it over. It's all I want to do. Just tip this thing over. See if I can drive on the wheels. <laughs> That's all I want. <coughs> That's all I want out of life. Is can I tip over? All right, here we go. Tip us over. Well, that worked out well, didn't it? Try one more time. Maybe a little less thrust. Alright, here we go. Push him over, push him over, way over. Here we go. There we go. Stop, 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 stop driving. Okay, I think we'll be okay though. I think we'll be okay for the purposes of what we want to do, which is land on the moon. All right, so down here, we're going to turn off the steering on those. Turn off the steering on those. No steering on the, oh, actually, I want to load my other one, okay. Uh, yeah. 
Very good. Okay, <clears throat> now we want to turn off the steering on the back wheels. And on the back wheels. Okay, so now the question is how will we get this lifted up off the ground so that this can dock with the other uh, the other mechanism? Should I get some little thrusters? Kind of similar to what I just did for for fun, but you know, just some little. Or maybe I should use. Maybe I should use the Werner engines. Um. Hmm. Thruster power twelve. I think maybe I should. Just put a couple of these bad boys on here. I mean, it, eh, well, let's just use these because um, the others use uh, rocket, basically rocket fuel, and these just use RCS fuel. All right, so. Just line our bellies with it. Okay. Oops. And then, um, I guess we need some down here too. Let me guess. They're gonna they're gonna stick out like they did over there. <laughs> Okay. All right. Uh, that might work. Maybe. Might work. All right. So, <clears throat> ugly as sin, of course, as are all of my designs. Not much torque, so that's good. And maybe this will work. Maybe this will work. Let's get up to the moon and and see what happens. Let's get up to the moon and see what happens. Okay. Beautiful. All right. I don't know about beautiful, but functional hopefully all right let's try it let's get this thing up on the moon oh yeah an ore hauler hopefully we have enough fuel to get back up into orbit that's um, I may have to send a secondary ship that this can dock up to that would then um, basically rendezvous with the ship to bring it back to Kerbin. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how this works. Alright. Let's get this bad boy up into space if we can. Utilize our solid fuel boosters as much as possible. Do a little bit of a gravity turn. It's, it's kind of tough while we're still in this high atmo. Or, I mean, uh, heavy atmo. Okay. Come on, SRBs. Get us up there. Here we go. And detach. Let's get this baby up there. All right, I used a little more fuel than I would have liked, but we have our encounter with the moon. And we are now on our way to 
establish an orbit around the moon and then land on the moon hopefully with a little more precision than we uh, had with the <clears throat> the the or hauler mk2 oh it wasn't awful but it comes right down to it wasn't good enough it wasn't good enough is what i like to call it so let's go ahead and get into the position we want here we're gonna have to use a little bit of our lander's fuel unfortunately to establish our orbit that's that's really unfortunate and we're gonna have some space junk so yuck all right and i should have adjusted my orbit just a little bit to get us a little closer because i actually want to be a little bit closer in there but oh well it ease what it ease and out of fuel all right let's dump that and dump that and activate this engine there we go and bring her on in and want to get to be a pretty close like within 50 there we go all right so let's go ahead and warp over here get within 50 on this side oh whoa 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 whoa, whoa. retrograde my friend retrograde as a waste of fuel. You know what retrograde is, don't ya? Means slowing down, buddy. Not speeding up. Who's driving this thing? Okay. Now here's the uh, lunar operations base. Here's the uh, couple of miners. And then over here we have the other miner and the other ore hauler. So I think we'll warp over to this guy uh, do, 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 do. Let's, let's warp here and then we'll um, see where we're at <clears throat> lots of tests lots of testing I'd like to have like a massive rah, rah, like cargo ship that just hauls ore. You know, that would be really cool. But I don't know what the logistic possibilities of that are incurable. Alright. We're going to assume that we can achieve this. Actually. go just like so okay all right let's do it it's a one minute burn so I think we'll be okay at our normal warp to location here because we're going to get down to 30 seconds we're gonna burn so look it's already drifting what the heck Oh, because the planet's moving. Yeah. Dummy. Dummy. Um. Alright. Let's try that. 30 seconds. I'm going to do a full burn. Ready. And. I don't know if it's just right or not. Let's do it. Burn some fuel off. Okay. Oh boy. Oh boy. All right. 
This is gonna be good. It's gonna be great. I just know it. I have a feeling. I have a feeling in my heart that this is gonna be great. And bingo. Bingo, bango, bongo. This is where we're landing. This is where we're landing. Okay. We are falling now for all intents and purposes, right? Yeah. Horizontal speed is only 2.34. I like the way this thing moves a little better now that we have a reaction wheel on there. That's good. Makes me feel a little more comfortable. 8600 oh, 8, is our suicide burn. So let's get down to closer to that. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Burn a little soon. Because I just want to be safe. May have burned a little late for all I know, I don't know. Where's our buddies? Is that them? Did we land right by them? Is that rocks? Is that debris? It's hard to tell. Hard to tell. No, that's them. I think we did it. Nailed it. Okay. Guess I could kill it a little bit. Um. Uh, hmm. Burning up some fuel here. Yeah, we're. I'll, I'll let it happen. Let it happen. Okay, so we're, we're getting close here. Yeah, we'll, we'll let us drop just a little quicker. It's gonna take forever, okay. And... I love that we got so close, man. That is awesome. It's the best I've ever done. Okay, here we go. Yeah, let's just drift down. Slowly. If we get it under four, that would be ideal. Okay. Ooh. Easy killer. Okay. We did it. We did it. Okay. That's the advanced grabbing unit. Okay. I forgot that the docking port was broken. Oh, but it does have an advanced grabbing unit. Let's arm it. Okay. <laughs> Can we? If I take off the wheels here, take off the brakes, I can't control it, but can I drift? Over that way. I'm kind of surprised it's going uphill. Okay, that's not gonna work. Let's just stop it. We're gonna try. We're gonna try our original plan, which is to let this guy here. Go over there. All right, I'm gonna save it because this might take a few tries. This might take a few tries. Okay, turn on the RCS. Let's take the wheels off. There we go. There we go. Boink. Oh, lovely. Lovely. Okay. I love it. Okay. <laughs> Look at those little wheels. 
They're so cute. How come these guys are steering? I do not want you steering. I thought I turned all that off. No steering, please. Turn off SAS. I think that... No, no, it's it's not causing a problem. Jeez. Look, <laughs> what is happening here? All right, it's having trouble going up a hill. Okay, turn on the RCS. Go up the hill. There you go. I don't know if the RCS will be able to pick us back up and let us take off, but we'll see. Let's just worry about one thing at a time. Let's get connected first. Let's get connected first. Connected. All right, let's turn off this. Woo, all right. Now we are going to transfer the ore from you to you. Out, in. Transfer that ore. Boom. Nailed it. All right. I'm excited about this. I am excited about this. All right. Very good. Let's save it again, and then I'm going to go ahead and deploy my radiators and my drills. I'm going to start drilling again. Bzz. Even though these are my pilots, so they don't they don't do as much ore handling as the engineers would. I'm gonna go ahead and pass time by here. Let them do some more mining. Gotta wait for a day to go by. There we go. Mining. Commence. Alright. Alright. So I think we're full up now. Both of these tanks are full. This guy is full. <clears throat> and I think we what we're going to do before I take off is I'm going to go ahead and start converting some of our ore to uh, fuel here. So we're going to fill this canister up with some of our fuel, or some of our ore. Refuel our tanks over here. And then, um, then we'll take off and fly back to Kerbin. I mean, might as well refuel our tank. I mean, that... <gasps> what? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, so... <laughs> Next episode, we will we will redo our war because, quite frankly, I'm not gonna uh, I'm not gonna do that. So, I uh, hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, throw me some likes, leave me some comments, and as always, subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.